Hello all my lovely weirdos. Welcome back to the channel. This is Donna's Life and today I'm coming at you with yet another Spell Queen unboxing. And by unboxing, I mean I'm just kind of showing it off because I've already taken everything apart. I got these a few months ago and um, wanted to make sure that everything was here and it is. And now I'm showing it to you. So if you're interested in seeing the loveliness of this diamond painting, stick around and we'll get right into it. Go ahead and shine, darling, go All right, you guys, so this is number three and I've already unboxed two and I will actually have them up in the info card at the top here. The kits come in these canvas bags with the diamonds in the middle and the actual diamond painting kit kit comes separate in the box because it's so large. So it comes in this bag. It comes with a regular diamond painting pen. It's got the single placer on one end and actually this is a four placer and it's also skinny tips. So it comes with a squishy for your pen. Just stick it on there and it helps your fingers. <laughs> and then you also get um, as a promotion or as something that they do that's just unique from, from other companies, they let you pick a special pen. And there's four different styles that you can pick. And then of those four, there's different colors as well. I have one other one. I gave away the other two I had. That Also, this is a style that it comes with too, with a little kind of uh, diamond on the top. And then you just take it off and you have your, your single placer there. You get a pot of wax. So it's got the Spell Queen logo and there are four plates of wax inside. You get the famous but deadly murder tweezers uh, with the Spell Queen logo on it as well. And then you also get a little 12 um, case organizer. And my favorite part of the kit is the the trays. The trays are the big white trays with the spout. The ridges are high so that they catch the diamonds and line them up when you're shimmying them around. Um, and then also when you're shaking them around, they're not going to fall because the sides of the tray is actually higher. And they have their Spell Queen logo on the back of that as well. So I'm going to just clear all this away and then we will get into the meat of the video. So one thing I like about um, Spell Queen is that they their, their canvases come inside these sort of, I don't know, it's the same material you'd find in like a Dollar Tree or a Dollarama shopping bag, those ones that you buy, uh, the green ones, only not green. So it's just, it's nice, it's protective, it's good to keep the dust off it. Um, I like them, it's a nice touch. And of course it has their logo on it as well, as well as their unique art that sparkles. All right, so we have it here. I finally got it out of the package and I'm just gonna roll it out for you. I don't think I'm gonna be able to catch the whole thing, but I certainly will um, bring it down so that you can see it all. So it is a poured glue. It comes with a clear uh, cover. So the thing I like about the clear covers is you get to see what the painting looks like right away. It makes it easier for that, but I'm going to be taking the clear cover off and putting release papers on top. Uh, that I just got off of Amazon. And if you'd like to see that haul, I'll link that up above as well. Okay, so here we go. I, one thing, uh, I thought all of this was gonna be black and it is actually 939, so not black. In fact, there is not any black in this canvas whatsoever which shocked me, um, but it is an elephant, just kind of, I think, playing in water, maybe playing in water, blowing the water up, and then um, you can see his herd in the back. So I think it's just, it's beautiful. I don't know, I think elephants are so majestic and I really love them, and when I saw this, this just spoke to me. <laughs> I love, and two, I love that the water, instead of it being water, it's colorful and a little bit abstract, which you all know I like. So that's the picture. It's so pretty. I don't know, I, I just think it's, and it, it's pretty and it's fun. And then it's a 45 by 60. Um, and I'm gonna just give you a quick scan of the, while I'm holding it up here, of the, um, the symbols. So all of the symbols look really clear. There are some dark, letter on dark color. I don't particularly like that. Not most people don't, but when I'm looking at the canvas, I don't 
really think I'm going to have an issue with it. So I'm going to zoom you down into the canvas itself so that we can take a look at the, the drill field. So one of the things I always like to show off with the um, Spell Queen canvases is that they have sparkle and I think you're getting a good view of just the little, oh, I have to find you, the little pieces of sparkle all throughout. And all of their canvases are like that. Um, and I really like it. I think it's nice. I don't think it'll change the aspect of the picture at all, but it is just a nice little touch again. And these things that you're seeing here, that's just the plastic coating. It's not uh, bubbled in the glue at all. There's there's good opportunities for multi-placing definitely on this. Um, and I do like that. This will be interesting to do. So I think you guys get the, the idea. Um, so top of the canvas always, oh, you can even see the sparkle up there. <laughs> Uh, top of the canvas always has their logo and then of course the unique art that sparkles i just love that and then as well on the bottom i will show you that they have the free odd dam insurance so that means if you spill your diamonds or if there are not en enough diamonds or whatever they've got you covered and it says five star in satisfaction so just contact them they do have the scalloped edges so you should not have any fraying. I guess fraying would be the best word. Um, the canvas itself, oops, I'm fucking the microphone, is extremely soft. It, it's like, honestly, I could sleep in this material. It's so soft. The edges are um, perforated and the plastic covering does sit in the perforation. So what I have been telling everybody what I do is I just simply take my tweezers, run them up along the side, and then just do it like that and it pulls it out. If you don't do that and you, do, you aren't aware of that, you could be lifting it and then rip your paper and your, your, you'll rip it like across here. So to avoid that, that's my little tip. So one other nice thing that, that they do is you have your logo on the top uh, left-hand side as well as the bottom right-hand side. And the picture is on both. The thumbnail is on both. One of the things I don't like about Spell Queen is that they don't give you a sheet with the legend. Um, so I'm going to have to take this and actually put it, try to fit it on my photocopier <laughs> and photocopy this legend. Um, I'm just going to flip this around so that I can show you the drill. The drill quality is fantastic. Um, I won't show you every single one, but there's beautiful colors in here. A lot of grays and dark colors as well, but that pop of color for the water is, um, there's lots. So that is one drill and like, look at those drills. They're in great shape. This is one of the dark color. I think this is the uh, 939. It's the bag is so full, there's not even anything, but I just, I don't see any junk. The drill, uh, the drills themselves all look to be uniform in shape. Just really, really good quality. Here's a lighter one. You can see a couple little divots in them, but that's like, that's not gonna be an issue for sticking on the, it's when you get the concave ones. But I don't see any junk. I, I don't know. They must have some way of sifting it out or something. I don't know, but they're in really good shape. Let's put a color. This is pretty. Almost like a bubblegum pink. Barbie pink, maybe. So you guys, like, honestly, really, really, really good quality. I'm looking forward to kidding this one up. Yeah, really pretty. Okay, so I'm not going to show, like I said, I'm not going to show them all to you. I think you guys get the idea. One of the things I do like, though, is that each of them come in their own baggie. So if you did not want to work from any kind of a storage container, you could essentially work from the baggies. I will be transferring these into probably the Doris knockoff that I just got and have to see how they do in there. But that's the drills. So there you have it, guys. This is the painting. I'm really excited about it. So you got your drills, you got your cool kit, everything you need to start. And the nice thing about um, Spell Queen is that 
um, their shipping is a month, but once, so part of that time is processing. Once it's gone through all the quality checks and processing, the shipping itself takes like a week, uh, maybe slightly more, but it, it made it on time and it came from China. So really, really impressed with this company. I hope you guys will give them a try and also would love to hear if you have given them a try. I've asked this question before, but if you have, what has your experience been with them? Did yours come in the canvas bag? I've heard a few people say that theirs did not. All of mine came in the bag. They're all the same size. And so I don't have a different size to compare it to so far as how it came, but they all came in one box four bags of these and then my four paintings so all right there you have it so this is a spell queen kit uh this is the elephants in the water is what i'm calling it because there are no names on this canvas but yeah i really 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 like this and I have decided that this is going to be my next project. So I am very eager to get this one kitted up. I'm probably going to try out the Jerry storage that I just got. And I have a couple new things I just purchased off of Amazon that I'm going to utilize in this painting as well. If you guys like this video and would like to see more videos like this video, um, please give me a thumbs up and then as well subscribe to the channel if you're not already. I'd love to have you be part of the family. I hope you guys are all having a really good night. Most of all, I hope you guys are all staying safe in this crazy world and finding something in your day to make you smile. Take care, you guys. I love you very much. Bye.